What's up guys? Hope you're doing all are well. My name is Ramit and today our topic is to download a PDF file from server and then store it into internal storage and get the file from internal storage and show it into a PDF view and while it is downloading show some progress like 20% 50% so this is our tutorial so let me show you the output of the video first so it is installing meanwhile let me tell you this tutorial contains five things you will know how to download how to show progress how to store in internal storage how to get from internal storage and how to show it into a PDF view look the progress 50% downloaded 70% ninety ninety hundred and done so guys this is our PDF file so let me install this application and walk through you to the code so here simple I'm using a main activity just a single activity and I'm using these files this is color nothing extraordinary just simple and this is our activities layout you can use whatever you want activity or fragment I'm using activity so in our activity we have relatively layout we have a seek bar we have a text view text view I'm using to show the value of progress though there's that 20% 40% this is the text view and here we just have a PDF view okay let me just show you the activity file Java file the Java file we have a PDF link okay server link and this is my underscore PDF dot PDF this will be the file name this will be my PDF name when I will store this PDF into my internal storage and here we have three fields nothing serious we are initializing these two fields we are initializing seek bar here and here I'm changing its progress drawable color seek bars and here I'm changing the thumb color and here set on seek bar change listener on progress change I'm calculating value progress seek bar dot with minus three seek bar dot get offset get max that's it divided by get max so here maybe you will get confused by this three this three minus three I'm using because seek bars thumb has more width than our text view so to normalize this I'm using minus three that's it and that's it for this and now for the download part download PDF I'm passing my PDF here my PDF name file name and in doing background I'm hoping you guys know the know something about async task if you don't know you can ask me in the comment channel or comments or you can check on Android's developer site just normal text normal async task and to download PDF just ignore this file for now just use this file file output stream this method open file output I'm using this this method Android has given us this method which is just used to create a file output stream from our internal storage we just need to pass our file name here which is our in our case it's my underscore PDF so here I am creating a URL connection content length here I am creating a data and that's it so for the main part this is the main part we have total and count okay which will gonna use to count the percentage of progress here input dot read file how uh, it means it, it is just calculating the read file how much it's done and how much is remaining that does the input file has has something to read or not 
this line is just to this and here we are calculating the count and we are dividing we are multiplying total and dividing the content length so which will gonna give us 0 to 100 percentage and here just we are writing the data and when we are done with everything here on publish progress we are just publishing this progress sigma dot set progress and that's it so when we are done we are returning true so after doing background post execute method runs so if suppose this this will return true so our post execute will get here return true return true means we have successfully downloaded the pdf if we get return false then we will get false here that means we are unable to download this pdf so open pdf method here i am creating a file from get file stream path this is another method of android which is just used to get the internal file storage here i am passing just file name and getting file so in the locate i'll show you the exact path of this and here i am hiding out the seek bar when when pdf has been downloaded now our time is to show the pdf so we will gonna hide the seek bar and we will gonna show the pdf view now what is this pdf view let me show you to get this pdf view you need to download this library just no need to download this just compile it into your app.gradle dependencies so copy this line this line sorry copy and paste it into your app module spill.gradle and sync project that's it i'll put this link in description so and you can also copy these lines and paste in into your activities main here so guys after after downloading the file you should hide the seek bar and show the pdf view and this is the code of the pdf pdf view from file here this is the file enable and blah 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 load at the end this is the code of this library you can check from it from here now guys let me tell you what is this so as i told you this method is same like this method okay this is androids androids method which will be gonna pass the only the file name inside this method and we will get this internal file okay so if this file is exist that means if yes our internal storage has this file then return true return true now we don't need to download file again because we already have it we don't need to download it again so here we will get true here and open file so this will open the file yeah. now suppose if we don't have the file this code will run if we have the file then this code will not run and our application automatically picks up the code from here the PDF file from here mm. I think guys we are done if you guys have any question you can ask me on uh, comment section so let me show you the PDF file show you the project again and look this will be our PDF files path so as I install the application and installing again when you install the application and install your over our all internal storage gets deleted automatically because android stores internal storage inside our app folder so when you unsolve the application app folder gets deleted and automatically so guys look we are done 
and you can double tap it here you can read you can change the orientation oops here yes and this is the path we have look when you will install this application this folder will get deleted so all these files will get deleted so here is our application so guys if you think this video is worth please like it share your comments share the video subscribe my channel and hit the bell you guys are not commenting please do comments and also please subscribe just for motivation thank you guys thanks a lot bye bye and also let me show you one last thing if you close the application and run it again look the pdf file is not downloading because our app is picking the data from internal mm. this code due to this code okay guys thank you bye bye please do like and share thank you